with me today. I have the components that you will need to make your solar panel module charge with natural sunlight. You're going to need, you're going to need the motor that you've made and also the solar panel module that you've made. You take your 23 centimeter wires and take the coverings off them, but before taking the covers off them, you twist them. And even after you take the coverings off, you twist them a little bit more just to make sure you haven't got any loose wire strands. As you can see, I already attached a wire to the coil of the motor already just to test it out and see how you meant to place it in. What I gathered when I was testing this out is that because the wires are so fragile and thin, take something no thicker and no longer than a, an unwound paper clip and use that to guide the wire through the coils. So I'll show you how to do that. You take your wire, this one, this wire I've got is the white wire, and I'm going to put the white wire onto the negative side of the motor using the paper clip as a guide to help kind of guide the wire into and secure it into the coil. Push the wire down, there we go, with the paper clip. And when you think that the wire is in a secure manner, you take the clip out and while trying to keep the wire in the coil like so now you have both wires attached to the motor now same thing again you have the wire, make sure there's no loose strands on it. Take the clip, hold it in line with the wire. With this, I've got the white wire, which is already plugged into, let's say, clipped into a negative side of the motor. I'm going to put it into the positive side of the solar panel module like so. So again making sure that the wire is in place hold it down for a little bit not too long you don't want to risk bending it and then Ooh, nope and take the clip out when you're ready and think that the wire is in a secure enough place as you can see this takes a little bit of patience a little bit of time But slowly, surely you'll be able to get the wire in place like so. And now I'll do the same thing again, attaching the green wire this time to the negative side of the solar panel module so again paper clip down into the coils when you think it's secure enough try and take the clip out but leaving the wire in place like so and of this, you have your solar panel and motor connected together. And 
like so. But I'm going to take the white wire out as it needs to probably be more upright instead of facing downwards, it should be facing up. Maybe it doesn't matter, maybe it does, but for because the instructions say well have it up, you might as well follow the instructions to ensure that this actually works properly for future purposes and future builds of different solar panel solar powered systems. Again, just repeat the same thing again. Maybe try it a few times to make sure the wire is in securely. And when you think you're done, take it to a sunny spot in the house in contact with direct sunlight and it should charge. I suggest probably charging it throughout the whole whole day just to make sure that everything is charged and working and that when it comes to you making anything now you know that it's been in direct sunlight for at least 12 hours possibly more hopefully more so right now I've made it I'm connected all wires facing the right direction Mm. Yep, that's all.